Hey everyone, in this quick video, I wanna show you how to scan QR codes with your iPhone. So QR codes are meant to send you quickly to a website or to a product, and iPhone has it built in, the scanner built into the iPhone with iOS 13 or later. But if you don't have that, that's okay. I'll also show you an app that makes the process super simple. So I'll show you both of those in this video. So to scan a QR code on your iPhone, go to the settings app here and then scroll down to your camera. So we're gonna go all the way down here to camera and right here, scan QR code needs to be on green. So it needs to be turned on. I'm gonna show you also an app if you don't have iOS 13, that works really well, but this is built in natively into your iPhone with iOS 13 and later. Now let's go back and now let me open the camera here and I have a QR code right here. So right here, you see scanner right here and it says open the website. That's what the QR code is acknowledging. So if I press that, it should open howfinity.com, which is what that QR code is meant to do. Now let me show you if your iPhone doesn't have that option, what app to use. Go ahead and go to the app store here and look up QR code reader. Just go ahead and search for that. And one of my favorite apps here is this QR reader for iPhone. Go ahead and download and open that app. And I'm on the home page here. So if you see on the bottom, I'm just on the home. I want to go to the camera icon and same thing. I could go ahead and just hover over the QR code on my computer here and immediately scanned it and took me to that website. So very fast, very easy to use. And if you press the barcode option on the top left here, it does have other options too. So besides just the code scanner, you could scan barcodes, PDF scanner, and so on. So I recommend using this app if your iPhone doesn't have that function. Otherwise, the iPhone native capability works pretty well. Thanks so much for watching this video. Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for easy to follow tech videos. And I hope to see you next time.